Hey, how y'all doing out there? This is Nico B, and this is the Black Journal, the world's most dangerous podcast. You know how we do things. Hit that like and subscribe button. Donate to the Patreon, the GoFundMe, and the Black Fund if you so see fit. All right, let me get into this, man. And in this topic, I want to, you know, i just been listening to, you know, I'm a fan of music. You know what I mean? Um, I, I've done music, you know what I'm saying, for a large part of my life. You know, um, music has been a big uh, influential part of my life and a lot of black people. Music and black culture is darn near synonymous. And that's why I want to get into this topic. And in this topic is titled, Rap and Trap Pop Are Not the Same Thing. So this new age music, which is not rap music, I call it trap pop, it's not the same thing as the rap music of old. It's not the same thing as uh, is a, a Snoop Dogg or a 50 Cent or, you know, it's it's not the same. We got to, you know, and we got to categorize this stuff different, you know what I'm saying, or else rap, you know, is starting to look foolish. It's starting to look like WWE and we starting to look foolish as consumers, you know what I'm saying, for, you know, you're an adult listening to this this foolishness. Because, you know, now rap has no spirit, you know, no message. You know what I mean? It's a lot of foolishness, a lot of taking drugs. You know, we used to have integrity back in the day, you know. And I'm not even talking about, and I say back in the day lightly, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about in the 2000s and 90s. I'm talking about in the, early, the 90s all the way up until like 2000 and, 2000 and maybe 8. You know, and I said, but you know, rap. The culture had integrity. Black people had integrity. Niggas, you know, even dope dealers was would tell you, nigga, you heard Easy E, nigga, don't get high on your own supply. You know, now you got these dudes selling, selling weed, selling panzanis and perks, and they popping them. They trying to sell. They can't sell the syrup because them niggas didn't drunk at all. You know, and this stuff is is bad because you know once all of this stuff, you know, the the money dwindled down, you know, which is inevitably does. You know, then all they gonna have, you know, they ain't gonna be able to get the access to that stuff no more. So now they gonna have to go to get the street drugs. That's gonna be the new heroin addicts, man. The new crack addicts, you know, the new Kates. You see these people nah, nah, if it's all type of street drugs out here. You know that these dudes be and people be on drinking all this alcohol. And all this culture promotes is being baby daddies and, and baby mamas. And foolishness, man. And really, lyrics is not something that's champion. The only people rapping these days is, you know, the old school rappers. And I'm saying, oh, rap is like dog. Rappers age in dog years. You know, the old school rappers are like maybe 40, 40, you know. So Jay-Z is like the, uh, uh, definitely, like I would say, the only, like, le one of the only legends still in the game, still spitting, like, on that he went off on that Meek Mill's um um was free on that new champ Meek Mill's championships. Yeah, he he did that. But you know, that's what I'm saying. So lyrics is not value, it's more so auto tune, a lot of you know, a lot of uh chanting about taking drugs, chanting about I'ma sleep with your chick, you know, I'ma sleep with your nigga. All this foolishness, don't get me started. On the female rappers, like the female rappers are just garbage, like you know. And I mean, and I say that lightly, like you know, not saying as a person, like, but look at they what they perpetuate. And they know damn well that uh, a lot of young girls and and people listen to that. Man, my niece was talking about her favorite <clears throat> rapper was Cardi B. She can't even say that Cardi B, Cardi B. I'm like, what? How you even find out about Cardi, Cardi B and you this young? You know young girls look up to y'all, but y'all still perpetuate this foolishness. Sucking dick. You know, sleeping with everybody. You know what I mean? Uh, putting it, just busting everything loose. Pretty much sex to get sex for money. That's what y'all promote, man. You know what I mean? Then, don't get me started on these women who talking about killing. Every woman is a bitch. Y'all calling all your sisters bitches. You know, everybody, all the bitches under you. They can't, you know, that you better than them. You know, who want to who wanna deal with that foolishness? And, and look at what's happening with our culture and our young women. They coming up with this, you know, you, 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 you spend this, then you get this type of mentality. And it's because of y'all. Like I said, this is not rap. This is not hip-hop. Whatever this is, this is trap-pop. 
you know and this stuff here is is like i said a bunch of foolishness it's no more real gangsters you know <clears throat> around no more real gangsters left it's no more you see all this stuff going on people snitching and it's no more cold really like these gangs don't really stand for what they supposed to stand for you know People just calling themselves Bloods and calling themselves Crips or calling themselves GD, calling themselves whatever. You know, they not standing for no code and no protocol with this. You go to jail, ain't no no big homies paying your bail or nothing like that, man. You just dead in the water, you know, and it's a sad story and it's not no it's nothing to glorify. Basically, now rap is all about who's popular. Not if, not who can rap. If they like you, don't matter what you do, you know, no matter how you, you know, put uh, lyrics and linguistics together, wordplay, do you take time on your crap, do you even write your raps, it does not matter anymore. You know what I'm saying? This is something else. This is all pop. Like, it's more trap pop. It's just entertainment. And if you're looking at rap for more than entertainment, you stupid and you need to have a dunce cap on. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's why, I mean, you know, I wouldn't let my kids listen to this stuff. My brother don't let his kids, you know, listen to this stupid-ass music, you know what I mean? Why? Like, it's not perpetuating nothing good. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day. You know, so that's all I want to say with this video. I'll make this quick. Like, no more, you ain't got no more public enemy. You know, Pac is gone. Big is gone. You know, no more... KRS ones, no more gang stars. It's, it's nothing, no more substance. Like I said, now it's pretty much the uh, inmates is running the asylum. You know what I mean? And, and at the end of the day, the bigger picture is these same execs and you know these white business owners and you know these old heads, these people who own these businesses, and even you know people of your own color. You know what I mean? Who uh? want to manipulate you this is easy this is not this is great for them this is gravy for them you know they know they got them a bunch of people they can manipulate you know throw some women and some drugs at you know use up get them out of there i'll tell you use them up get them out of there and and re rinse and watch the cycle and keep polluting the culture you know what i mean all right so it's your boy nico b black journal follow this man you know what i'm saying if you ain't uh subscribe hit that subscribe button man you know we come with a lot more content you know, I'm going to come with a lot more videos, um, you know, like I said, uh, to, to just improve the channel, a lot more things, you know what I'm saying, a lot more uh, better camera footage and, and different things. <clears throat> but definitely check out the merch, man. You know, we got different type of uh, merch, you know, we definitely the hoodie kings, you know, we keep uh, fly hoodies, you know, uh, fly clothes if you want to want to check out some uh, original uh, brand designs. You know what I mean? Check out the... Uh, I'll leave the link in the description box. All right, it's your boy Nico B. Black Journal. I'm out.